Hey everyone, I'm Ellen here at eTrailer.com and we're going to be taking a look at the ToeSmart Trailer Hitch Lock. Now this works for both Class 2 and Class 3 hitches and it's pretty easy to use it in both. The way it works is that it just is reversible, so you just switch from one side to the other per whichever hitch you have and the diameter of each side is a little bit different. So on our thicker side, that's going to be for our Class 3 hitches, for the thinner side, that's going to be for our Class 2. This is going to be a half inch diameter and then the Class 3 is going to be five eighths of an inch in diameter. So that eliminates the need to have two different pins for our different size hitches. If you maybe change vehicles and go from one to the other, you'll always know that this is going to work for whatever hitch you might have and should be a nice, easy way to keep track of that. It does come with two keys to unlock that and really just to go from one to the other. Right now I'm on the class two side, so that half inch diameter side put in my key, unlock it, switch it over to the other side, lock it down, and boom, that's all there is to it to, whoop, to switch from one to the other. Of course, you want to make sure that you actually have it locked, unlike what I just did. Put that key in there. There we go. Now it's locked. So pretty easy way, pretty ingenious design to work for both sizes. It's pretty simple, honestly, from just looking at it, I wasn't sure what the big deal was, and then I realized that it was actually two different thicknesses. So it's kind of hard to see, but this is going to be the thinner side, and this is that thicker side. So as far as the length of our pin, it kind of depends on which side you're using. The class three is going to be a little bit longer of a configuration. Overall, measures about six and a half inches long from the end of the lock to the end of that pin there. If we go just to where it bends, it's about five and a quarter inch to there, just to give you an idea of the clearance for mounting in any of those kind of tight quarters hitch spaces. Some factory hitches can have kind of limited space. So hence why that measurement can sometimes be important. And then if we flip it over to the class two side, now it's just about six inches long. And to that same part of the bend, it's about four and three quarters rather than five inches. So just a little bit shorter on this side. The barrel of our lock is about one inch in diameter. As you can see, it does have a rubber cap to keep out any water and grit and grime from getting in there and gunking things up. The actual pin is stain or a solid steel construction with a chrome plating to help keep it protected from any kind of rust and corrosion. It is covered by a one year limited warranty. You can use this for both cargo carriers, spike racks, and also for your ball mounts so it can be used for those towing applications. Should be a pretty nice sturdy ball or sturdy hitch pin for all kinds of uses. You can have this, like I said, with multiple vehicles and no worries about the change in size. So should be a pretty easy and uh, space saving option for you. Well, I hope this video has been helpful in deciding if this is the right pin for you. Again, I'm Ellen here at eTrailer.com. Thanks for watching.